All right, guys, so the temperatures, they are starting to creep up and soon you'll be blasting that AC. Chip Gabbard, the owner of MVP Air Conditioning, Heating, Plumbing and Electric, actually spoke with us. And here's what you need to do now to prepare your AC for a real summer workout. The first thing they can do is go out and change their air filter for one. A lot of our customers have a nice a high efficiency five inch wide filter that we can get six months out of and, and change it just once before every season. But if we, if some of our customers have the little one inch filters and if they have something like if they have pets, hardwood floors where a lot of, where all that stuff gets drawn into the system, then sometimes those might be changed every month. If the filter is dirty, that air can't go through there like it should. And so the air conditioner won't cool like it's supposed to. It can freeze up. And if the air conditioner freezes up, then water, once it thaws out, that water runs down into the furnace, can damage the furnace board and all the controls. So it's, it's, it's super important to have, have a filter in it and one that's not clogged up. What they'll see is better airflow throughout the house. They'll see lower heating and cooling bills because their system won't have to work as hard. And if they use, uh, one of the, one of the, some of the fancier filters, it also keeps the air cleaner. A lot of them filter out stuff like pollen, pet dander. If we can catch all that stuff in the filter and not pump it out through the house, it makes people breathe easier. Uh, we can also supplement that with a UV light or an air purifier to kill also viruses and bacteria and stuff like that. They can also hose off the outdoor unit. Just make sure that their, their air conditioner outside isn't covered in leaves, debris, grass clippings, cottonwood and pollen and everything gets, it's, gets drawn in through those coils and pulled up through there. If that stuff gets built up, maybe they didn't rake their leaves last fall, that air conditioner has to breathe. It has to have air pulled in it from the, from the outside up through the coils and through the top. If it can't get that air through there, then it doesn't work right. It won't cool properly, it'll run too hot, it can damage the unit make it overheat. So it's a good start for a homeowner to just kind of squirt it off with the hose. It's not the same as us doing a system revitalization. What we do is a much more thorough process that makes the efficiency better. But for a homeowner, a good start is just uh, hosing it off from the outside. Schedule an appointment online at themvpkc.com or call Chip and his team at 913-322-0868.